Gatsby's Bark Box came in the mail. Woo! I had mentioned before, but Bark Box is like a dog subscription service where they send the dog treats and toys and everything like that every month. These are stuff that you can't usually find in stores. Anyway, so Gatsby's getting all these stuff from Bark Box that they send. So this is your July subscription. You want to see what's inside? Let's see. This is your Bark Box stuff. <laughs> what's in here? Ooh, look at all these treats. Oh, you already found a toy. What'd you get? An elephant? Is that your elephant toy? Show it to the viewers. Oh, look. Oh, so cute. Oh, Gatsby, it's an elephant. Eugene the elephant. What else did you get? Come on, Gatsby, come on. Let's see, let's look at the other toys. What else did you get? What's inside of here? What is this? This looks like a toy that you threw around. Oh, it has squeakers inside. Look. Hey, Gatsby, come on. It's wrapped. You can't eat that. A beef kneecap chicken biscuits. And we got a trailblazing blitz. Gatsby is considered a medium sized dog, so this is what the medium sized dog stuff. As I had mentioned before, BarkBox sent us all this stuff. They want to hook you guys up if you guys have a dog to get a free month with BarkBox. So I put a link in the description below. What you need to do is you just click on the link and if you subscribe for at least six months for BarkBox, then you'll get one free month, which is really awesome. Thanks BarkBox, as usual. Woohoo! What a happy doggy. So for breakfast, I've been making that protein pancake and it's been working pretty well. It makes me feel like I have a lot of energy. So we can do it again here. I can show you I was just making it. I like to make a smaller version. So I like to do five eggs, three egg whites, and two egg yolks. Half a cup of old fashioned oats and cinnamon over here. Pour it onto a greased pan here, like a pancake. Looking at the corners here. Still a little liquidy. Uh, I kind of flipped it. <laughs> Since I'm not counting my calories, butter and some jam on top. I just like to eat this because it, it feels like it gets me ready for the gym. Seated at the breakfast table, let's start the day. Okay, I just made it back home and we can go to a small little corgi gathering that we usually go to. Guess he's like, what? That's his what stance. I'm in my own lane. You ain't in my category. You like a RAV4. I'm like the Aventador. There's no corgis here. <laughs> There's one. Aw, sorry Gatsby. It's not going to be very fun without the corgis. You have a tail. enjoying the air condition. Unfortunately, there were no doggies at all. Someone recognized Gatsby though. He was like, Gatsby? Is that Gatsby? Other than that, there was nobody. We were too late, sorry. I got Gatsby a new collar for VidCon and for Corgi Beach Day. Look at how handsome he's gonna be with this. He got a bath, so he's all wet. Look at your handsome collar. So I'm getting ready to go to the aquarium store because I need to fill up with water. But I have two jugs of water that I can't remember if it's seawater or RO water, which is like the pure water. And you can't really tell from smelling it. So the only way is... <laughs> okay, that one's seawater. <laughs> Let's see what this one is. Cheers. Oh, oh. Definitely seawater. That one tastes like old. Okay, now that that's taken care of, let's head off to the aquarium store. So I just made it to Neptune Aquatics, the aquarium store that I like to go to. Bay Area is known for having really good aquarium stores. This is my favorite one that I've been going to since I got my aquarium. You guys wanted a tour, so let's get a tour of the aquarium store. This is outside entering. They have the seawater and RODI water here. You can enter into Neptune Aquatics.
So we are filling up on seawater right now. Okay, I got my waters and my sea hair over here. They know me pretty well there, so it's pretty awesome. Anyway, okay, gonna get back home. Up, down, inside, what the p it's lip slide. Would da could da shunda got your sugar, get your sugar. Checking out on my waters. So I got a baby sea hair here. For those of you who don't know, he's a slug that eats all the algae. I'll pluck as much algae as I can, because that's getting ridiculous. Okay, so I got my setup over here. Unfortunately, sea hares don't have like the best survival rate, so that's why I've been getting so many of them. <laughs> they do their job though. And now I'm just siphoning the water out. Okay, and now we fill it with the new sea water. Okay, just fill it up. Now let's check the salinity of the water. A little bit low. I was topping it off too much or something. I don't know. Okay, I just adjusted the water. I did another water change. The salinity went up a little bit. I'm just gonna stick the sea hair in now. Welcome to the tank. Enjoy. Come on, grab on. Grab on before you fly away. There he goes. Okay, there we go. All cleaned up and nice. We're driving off right now to get Gatsby a new tag for his collar. We need to get one so when we go to the Corgi meetup in SoCal, we don't lose him. It's like pet day today. Mm. And here it is. I gotta add it to Gatsby's new collar here. I wanted a gold one, but they didn't have gold. I looked at two different stores. So handsome. Yeah? <laughs> I'm going to meet my friend Shannon right now, who's visiting. Gatsby's pooping. There's Shannon. Hi. Yay! Did you get your Chick-fil-A? I did. She got her Chick-fil-A. Amazing. That's her, that's her thing. Gatsby's getting walked by Shannon. There it is. <laughs> Oh Shannon's looking gosh. at all my amiibos. Wow. <laughs> and, the and the golden Mario. The rare one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you did get one. The Animal Crossing. Oh yeah, I did. Why didn't you get a Wii Fit one? Because I need to get all of them. I like the Wii Fit one. The really? pose is cool. I don't know. I saw that in the stores and I was like, eh. But that's the, one of the holy trinity. I remember when it came out, I was like, who wants that? And it turns out I wanted it. So Shannon just left. Um, she was in on quite a few number of videos in the beginning. We were just catching up because I haven't seen her in a really long time. Anyway, so handsome. <laughs> please, please, can you play? This upcoming week is gonna be so crazy. I'm trying to prepare for it. VidCon, my dad's gonna be flying over because it's gonna be my birthday. And we have the Corgi Beach Day. And also my friends are gonna come over and we're gonna go to Disneyland on one of the days. I have to start preparing for everything. So tonight what I'm gonna do is I'm actually just gonna hang out with a few of my friends and we're just gonna play board games. I just don't vlog it because it's not fun watching people play board games. Like the ones that we play, we play like these strategic ones. So it's really just like, it's not fun to watch. Strong Corgi. In the comments post down how you found me originally if you can remember. I asked this before in the past. Did you find me when searching for corgis or how did you find me? Always interested to know. We're gonna make our meat sauce spaghetti as usual. So we got our ground beef. Gatsby thinks something's gonna be for him. Rosemary and thyme mix here. Oh, and spaghetti, of course. Here we go. is for leftovers. So there we go, I think I perfected my spaghetti making skills there after making it so many times. So it's dinner time. And bam, the kitchen's all nice and clean again. Time for bed now. We played so much, it was so much fun. We played Settlers of Catan, Star Trek edition, I have that. And then we played Dominion and we played a little bit of Wii U. Gatsby's tired too. The nice thing is that I taught him to play by himself. So when we're playing games and stuff like that, Gatsby's just like playing by himself. He was playing with his new elephant toy and with this rope and of course with the eye fetch. You had a good time too, huh? Yeah. 
So I woke up at like six. Right now it's like two in the morning, so. Anyway, I'm gonna head to bed. Say goodnight. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. So you guys have been asking for me to do an Amiibo showcase, so I thought that I would do it today. For those of you who don't really know what Amiibos are, they are Nintendo figures. They're not just a collectible figure, but you can scan them into your game. They have an NFC chip and a small memory file inside of them. Depending on the Nintendo game, they unlock or do specific things.